What is happening guys? Welcome to my channel. This is Blizzard Raptor. This is the channel where I play games for you entertainment and I offer my humble opinion on those games as well. If you are new here, do the YouTube stuff. Like the videos you watch, comment down below on the videos and most importantly subscribe to the channel. Stick around to the end to see more of the content this channel has to offer. And let's get on with Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So if you remember, we left off, I don't really like doing this, but we left off halfway through a quest. And I didn't really have much choice but to leave off halfway through this quest. Because we were getting kind of close to the hour and a half mark. And I really, when I started this series, I really only wanted the episodes to go for an hour. And yet each episode seems to have just crept up to closer to the hour and a half each time <laughs> so we're gonna try and keep this one a respectable length <clears throat> although I do appreciate all your support and I do appreciate you guys who go who sit through the full hour on the video honestly I cannot cannot thank you enough everyone for all the support And yeah, this is... We left off with... Treadwar... In dire straits because we've actually left him with the person that wants to kill him. Uh, thinking we were doing the right thing, of course. And it turns out we've been played. At every end. Bets that these stairs lead to the, uh, the 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 secret lair that she's supposedly got. I'm always worried that I'm dropping frames whenever I look at the the preview on OBS, but it's not. not be seen in this area. It's just because the the cards having to render that recording it always looks like it's dropping them but I've got zero dropped frames so far so I'm reading 60 FPS all the way so hopefully everything's good for you guys survey the areas I genuinely think we're here somewhere so let's just make our way up this way <clears throat> This is the last territory that we have to form an alliance with, so we'll see how it goes. The chanting. It's faint, but I recognize Mordran's voice. So it is under here. Yeah, yeah. I thought so. Guards, I'm not stupid. Mother is communing with the gods on this most holiest of times, and we're stuck guarding the door. I'd rather be out here in case the witch sour and the wind meal for the gods. Is it a quiet way in? I think so. I've got nine predator arrows. It is very tempting to just drop these guys. I don't think anyone's facing my way. If I... No, because if I drop here... Am I right in the mouth of the tunnel? No, the mouth of the tunnel's here. What do you think? Because I put my stealth stat that high from the the uh, Raven Tree, that um, I get I get away with getting spotted now. It, it's like they think it's just like oh, I never saw anything after all type thing. 
He did just get away with that one though. I'll stay crouched because crouch gives me the sort of radar. I can automatically see if enemies are hiding. So far I'm not having to use my torch as well so I'm okay. Now, looks like I'm going to have to go over this. Need to be careful here. It's going okay so far. Got these just in case you get hurt by the gas on the way in. I'm gonna have to fight here though or at least assassinate here I can see the ones closest to me but I want an idea who's here most of these guys seem to be sleeping so if we do this right that guy to the right, there's no point. He's not facing us and he's no threat. But that guy is. Or maybe he's not. Let's leave him alive as well. Then we've got to get up here. So we've killed some of the reinforcements that could come after us. Let's see. There's a bale of hay behind. What are these? Do you think these will explode? No. Well, it was a gamble. It's a gamble worth taking. Into it. Sharp. It has kind of moved them around a bit, though. Oh. Hey, wait. Stay awake. I am really going to admit that I got extremely lucky there. I don't care, I got lucky. That was... That that could have ended in a fight that probably would have brought the guys that I'd left alive in the tunnel back there. But you know what? It didn't. I got lucky, I got the, the, the second guy, the guy that I assassinated last, the second guy in the line, had turned his back to me completely. So I was able to do those assassinations, no problem. But that wasn't skill. You know, that wasn't like a uh, stealth game BR. Uh, one of the guys I know that does a lot of Assassin's Creed videos where he does... He doesn't just do Assassin's Creed. He does a lot of stealth kill videos with any game, but he's done a few Assassin's Creed ones as well, and he's, he's really good. Have I really good. Into this is a new realm entirely. Sweat and blood, death and birth. Turn this man from beast to earth. Modron! Stay your blade or die at my hand! I should have known Kunon wouldn't have it in him to quarter you for the dogs. 
It's a cold bitch who throws her lover to the wolves for her own crimes. You understand so little. No matter. Let me enlighten you with the fury of the gods! <laughs> I'm doing then. Take this. Try it again. Okay. Taste blood. Taste yours. Come on. Is she doing a runner? Okay. I'm gonna try and switch back over to the the hunter bow because I can shoot this faster. I've got six arrows for it though, I'm gonna need these. She's gonna come out up here. Die, Modron! I can shoot her off the... I can shoot her off the rope slides. Make me. Go on. Try. Bye. Do it then. Leave Gloucestershire in the hands of that Christian, and for what? Your name and some trade routes? Do you doubt the power of your gods to sway the mind of a man? Tefter is no longer the salad you believe him to be. A man will lie to save his skin. When you are gone, he'll gut me and burn my people. The gods showed me this. Kunan spoke of your vision. The Nornir spin their fatal threats. But without your plan, his heart would remain unchanged. Then I have no regrets. But I had a vision of you as well. One of a path that twists like the river owls. The seer's spinnings twist limb and word alike. Prophecy is a river, and we are powerless to fight its clutches. Oh, shit. She was fighting to protect her people. But she ground your name to dust. Sullied the honor of herself and her people. I'm not gonna kill her for that. I spared Kunan. Say your goodbyes and keep out of my sight, witch. Mother? What is this? Is this... Are we in hell? No, we are in England. Mm -hmm. How are you feeling? I feel well. <coughs> but it's a little fragrant in here, is it not? You will live to be Elderman yet, Tefter. Despite the many attempts on your life. Attempts? Untimely death? God's blood! You're safe. And the ceremony will proceed in Gloucester. Your wounds should heal by the next moon. If you get some rest. Then you have my thanks, Mother Modron. Lovely woman. Utterly terrifying, though. Let's return with haste. This cave is a place of nightmares. I'm hoping he doesn't remember much, because that might change him back to the path of zealotry. But that was good fun. I actually enjoyed that, like, thoroughly. Thoroughly enjoyed that. Now, while I'm here, let's see if I can find my way to...
the books and the armor and the treasure. Looks like they're above me. Gonna grab these because I'm here anyway, unless it's gonna involve traipsing through hundreds of tunnels. This place is heavily guarded. Are you kidding? You know what? I feel like exercising the muscles a wee bit. Now you have it back. Treasure room door key, that'll do me. You're for the midden, eh? Am I really? Right, where's the treasure room then? I just found your crappy key. So there must be more than one bit that I need to go into. Ugh. I want the book. Not my favourite. But I don't even think I've used it. Trigger a surprise assassination. Uh, that could be good if you were gonna roleplay a pure assassin. It's not my thing. I'm not gonna hang about and get the treasure. Um Gonna head for a way out.
and we'll fast travel back to Gloucester now. I quite enjoyed that. <laughs> I did that myself. Oh no, that's not Gloucester. Gloucester is not there either. It's here. There we go. Well done. I got there in the end. Yeah, it was quite good. I liked that. Yeah, some of these abilities, depending on how you want to play, I mean, you can't... You can't really build Eivor. Build, like, a unique Eivor. Like, every Eivor is basically going to be just returned. the same. But... What's this? You can... Build... Certain playstyles, if that makes sense. Like, you could totally go... Two big swords... Massive, um, like two, massive sword in each hand. Play all the, use all the sort of melee abilities and be like just smash your way to victory. Or you can play as a, an assassin. There's plenty of traps. There's that feigned death. All these sort of things. Gunner, it's good to see a face I trust. Even your frightful muck. I thought this could be our shared saga. But it's time to leave. We have spent not but a drink together. Worry not, Eivor. You and I have many tales to tell yet. And our names ring out clear and with honor. Yeah, a tale. A tale of Gloucester. Beautiful land. Full of damned fools. Ha! I will drink to that. You have my thanks. Anything for you, old friend. Then let us say our farewells to this wicker king. And then be on our way home. Yes, Ranvi will be eager to meet Bridget. Bridget and Gunnar have already gone ahead. I should join them. Here's Mother Mordred. Show me your prophecy, witch, and I shall give it. Modron. You are a great warrior, conqueror of this land and that of your birth. But at the end of all things, you will find yourself with nothing but your regrets. I... I see. The wicker man. We first met at Simkins Wicker Man Ascension. I was besotted with you at a glance. So long ago. Some poetic symmetry after twenty years' prosperity. Please don't do it! We can find something else! Someone else! Peace, dear heart. I will join the dirt that grows the trees and the barley, my body feeding the gods, worms, and even you. So I will be here. And a long long time from now when you're old and wrinkled like an apple you will see me again father i thought i could be ready it is time Then this is yours. The this is your crank. path, Tifter. No thorns and briars could keep you from it. And you, Eivor, friend of Gloucestershire, you have lived up to your reputation. I know you owe me less than nothing, but please, take care of them. I take no pleasure in the suffering of others. You would know this if you had given me a chance.
Twenty years I have been your elderman. Now these old bones are ready for my last duty. I have worked alongside you, clearing fields, brewing drink, births, and deaths. All growing and learning. The wicker man is ready, O king. Your altar awaits. I am honored to be your harvest king. With this flame set, may our crops be plentiful and our winters brief. Cool. Despite it all, he has the ending he prayed for. Straight to the mouths of hungry gods. And there he is, in his sacrificial altar. Abel, the honor is yours. Praise the Harvest King! Bloody pagans! Here we go. Seems the wind calls me back to Ranvi. Best tell her the good news. Fair news. Nice and short start to this episode in terms of ending that quest. Bit disappointed, but I would never have been able to push through last night without making it like a two hour episode clearly because that's us 28 minutes into uh, to this one so no regrets about cutting it short there's more story to be told anyway we still don't know what's going to happen with Sigurd I don't know if that's going to be enough I don't know if there's more that I'm going to have to do Must remember to do the feast next time. Basim. Basim, have you spoken with Sigurd lately? We talk from time to time. Why? Have you noticed any change in him? Any loss of, of happiness or feeling? He appears to me more thoughtful, introspective. Thoughtful? That seems an understatement. He speaks as if he hears the voices of the gods whispering in his ear. We live in a strange time, Eivor. Among stranger people. Sigurd may be among the blessed. But who can say for certain? Indeed. I know Basim hears it. Because I've played Mirage, and if you guys have watched Assassin's Creed Mirage on my channel, you guys know as well. And if you haven't, quick channel plug. Assassin's Creed Mirage is on there. You should Good go watch it. Good to see it. you, darling. You'll know more about... Basim. I can hardly begin to describe what happened in Gloucestershire. I think you will learn soon enough. But we are allied with them. Yes. For all our pains. 
And that's it. Can't do anything else with the map. I can speak to Randve, but that's oh, here we go. I want to see the Alliance map. There's nothing else for me to do here though. Okay. I have changed my mind. I should go. So Uber Ragnarsson has come. He claims to have some business with you. Uber Ragnarsson, you are a long way from your king's side. Eivor. Yes, a long stroll through the hills and fields of Mercia. Also, I could thank you. Thank me? For sending my brother to his just reward. In spite of the harm he caused you and everyone around you. I could not keep him in line in this life. But I have no doubt the old father will put him to good use in the next. A darkness followed your brother, one I am not sure he understood. But as you say, he is now where he belongs. He is. And as a show of my thanks, I came to offer you a gift. A token of my respect. Thank you. Put it to good use, Wolf Kist. And may we meet again soon. On a battlefield, if the fates are kind. What did he give me? A silver ring. Nice. So, quests. Oh, okay. Here we go then. What's this one? Oh, Boat of Melee. I want the healing ones first. What's this one? Ah, right, no, this is a way down here. I want to be up this way first. What's this? Light shield. I think everything up here is done. I just need to do these... Do these centre ones and then I can nip across and do these ones. Right, let's go see... Half done, but first we'll ring the bell, have a feast. Didn't see your Yarrow there. Yeah, let me see my inventory. Looks like there might be something amiss here. Moira. Who is Moira again? Was she his seer? Yes. 
think if I hadn't given him... If I hadn't given... Uh, what was his name again? Ivar the Boneless. If I hadn't given Ivar the axe and sent him on his way as a Viking warrior, I think with Uba that might have been a severance of the friendship between our two clans. But I, I didn't see the point in denying him because for all his madness, he was a warrior who lived that path. And I had no grudge against him. He fought me, yes, but I, I mean, I kicked his, kicked his ass. So yeah, I, I regret nothing in terms of um, fighting him. I think I gave him what he wanted, and through giving him what he wanted. I've kept that friendship between the Raven Clan. That if anything, this is the one that I had the most doubts about. And I'm not convinced this is going to turn out. That this is going to turn out the way I thought it was going to. I think Halfdan's going to be mental. Oh, Moira was the, the healer. That's who Moira was. She was giving him all the herbs and stuff. I wonder how Hafton fares now that he sits on the throne. So this that Hiritha is piercing her out. Moira may know where Hafton has gone. Moira, is something wrong? Weep for Northumbria. Is it Hafton? Has he gotten worse? His heart is broken. He's a mere shadow of himself. With Faravid lost and his brothers away, he wallows in paranoia and sadness. I could speak with him. Where is he now? Wandering the fields of Pichiringa with his beloved Bayonton. I'll find him. Thank you, Moira. Pichiringa is in the east. Just follow the road to Scarborough. Just <laughs> Do I have... No, I don't. But there is a direct road here. I'm sure there's a... Oh, no, here. There's a bridge, so... Back we go. Sorry, guys. There's going to be a long ride once I get... In fact, you know what? Maybe I can jump on my horse now. <laughs> It cannot end like this. I mean, Northumbria won't come to a standstill because he had able advisors. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Yeah, yeah, I might need to go further up. Yeah, Northumbria had able advisors that were able to keep things running. So between Holger and... Fact, it'll just be Holger at the minute that'll be able to stand in because I killed the other guy and Faravid's gone. But Holger will be able to keep things going administratively. It's just there's nobody here that can defend them, if you want to put it that way, like the monarch's duties. There's nobody to do the, the kingly stuff to rule, basically. Oh, it's hard. <laughs> And I can make the quest objective, that's perfect. One of the things I'm worried about is Mercia, because Cheowulf, Cheowulf's son got killed. And although we avenged it, I'm hoping we get Ivar's name out of it, otherwise that'll turn Cheowulf against the Norse. But I think we got away with that. But I'm worried that Jairwolf decides that because he lost his son, 
the AI either doesn't want to be king anymore or he wants the Danes out. Either one would be a bit of a disaster. I'm not going to see what that is. It'll just be treasure that I don't need though. I think of the other territories we've helped, but I think I'm on friendly terms with everybody else. Interesting. To be honest, this was the only one I, I really had any kind of worry about. Because I wasn't convinced that things had ended well with Afdan. Where is Pichiringa? Someone leave a, a comment and tell me because I don't know where Pichiringa is. If a fishmonger can't sell weak old fish, where's that husband of yours? Off fishing again. So he says, Let's do this quickly in case we need some persuasion. Ah, look at you, big and tall. What's your name? Eivor of the Raven Clan. Eivor of the Raven Clan? Come here, come closer. Do you like to drink? As I like breathing. And do you like to flight? I do. Well, listen, here these folk aren't impressed by the speed of your thinking. They will only respect you for how much you're drinking. If you're sober, then leave, for there's not here for you. Oh, I'll shut your big mouth while I finish my brew. That's the spirit. Now make your wager. The ale's free to those who flight. Thank. I'll buy you a round with my winnings. How's that? Ha! I like this one. Are you ready? What about one more drink before we begin? For luck. For luck. Skull. Skull. Your face is a wreck. You're a blight on the Norse. Your face brings to mind the arse end of a horse. Brilliant! 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 Yes! Have another drink. You're gonna enjoy this. Oh, I'm getting yes, wasted. Yes. Here's the next one. You're a pig-headed, ugly excuse for a dame. Well, you're a thick skull and loathsome and lacking a brain. You're brilliant. You're the smartest person I've ever met. You hold your own. Let's have another. I think Eivor's going to pass it after I'm this. I'm a champion, a winner. I'll claim the top prize. You can break a proper lies. <laughs> that was the most incredible flighting I've heard in all my years. You are a wonder. I say the same of you, friend. Three cheers for Eivor, the most masterful wordsmith in all of England. And now. I'm smashed. So he says, but the only thing he ever catches is more gambling debts. I fear I cannot keep him around. <sighs> You're better off I was hoping that was a... My husband should be back by now. A top up? The What's the word I'm looking for? I was hoping it would be he the tech. He along Scarborough shore beneath the Tower Ruins, does he not? That's foolish. The cliffs are too steep. One who has need of their wits wanders wide. I might find good fishing below the Scarborough Cliffs. Cast about this land. Okay. No glory, no hope. Nothing but snow, silent as a corpse in its grave. 
Stand up, Hafton. I'm taking you back to Jorvik. <laughs> up, my lord. You're a king. You're not allowed to sulk. Men bled and died to sit you on that throne. So go, sit. My brother, Ivar. Did he die well? He died fighting. You slew my brother and never said a word. You kept this from me. It was no secret. Uba knew, did he not? Leave me. I will not. I've come to see you safely home. Now get up. I... I mislaid my hammer. I think Beonton ran off with it, but I'm not... I'm not... Uh, I'm not well, Eivor. I'll find your hammer, and then you'll come with me. I was on my way to Scarborough. If you find my hammer, bring it to me there. Why is he on his way to Scarborough? That's not, I think it's Scarborough, by the way. I've been there, it's absolutely lovely. I love the place. I had a lot of fun while I was there. I've had two great holidays in Scarborough. Well, near Scarborough. A caravan park called Blue Dolphin. It's an absolutely lovely part of the world. Some really friendly people. I realised I resigned myself to run in here. I don't know why. I didn't think it was going to be this far. <laughs> why is the dog run this far with his hammer? Loki Rabbit, I call on you, nay demand of you. Send me a home gang champion to test my might. Your champion comes crawling back, Loki Rabbit. Good. I am ready. Yes, please. Show me what lies ahead. Oh, what? There is Beontan, guarding the hammer. You're gonna follow me beyond ten. Brilliant. Because this isn't technically a road. Here we go. We're on our way to the quest objective. Wonder if I'm gonna end up with Hafdan's hammer. Or if I'm gonna have to fight him for it. There's quests that you guys haven't seen because they're side quests and I don't really do side quests when I'm recording for you guys. But there are quests involving the... Drenger, the Shield Brothers, the Swarm warriors who followed Ragnar Lothbrok. There was one in Norway. Maybe I did record that one. Go back to the first or second episode and you might see it. It's, I go into a cave and fight one-on-one -on -one with a, an old guy who says he knew Ragnar Lothbrok and he, he wasn't there when Ragnar died. And he's been waiting in the cave either for death to find him or a warrior to come and give him a, a warrior's death, basically. Um, and I killed him and you get 
gear from them. You can get quite good gear, actually. Um, there is another one that I fought when I played this through the very first time before I started recording the series. Um, try uh, Scarborough looks a lot better than this, by the way. Wonder if I'm gonna need them. The lighthouse, Hafton awaits. This hammer is not meant to be thrown, Hafton. Remember that next time. He's gonna swing that him. <laughs> My father, Ragnar, he gifted this to me. Took it off a Finnish chief. Still warm with blood when he handed it to me. I had 14 winters. Ragnar Lothbrok was a great king. He's one of the sons of Ragnar. I think he must be the oldest then. He's going Finnish out. arrow killed my mother. Ooh. A shield maiden she was. As fierce as a wolf swallowing the sun. My father swore to kill the men who took her from us. And he did. Fourteen against one. But that was years ago in the east. And this is the west, where my father lies dead. A pile of bones in a pit of snakes. And here we are, still telling stories of his life and deeds. Because he was How a great king. How did my brother die? With his hand on his axe, awaiting the maidens of the battle slain. Now he drinks at our father's side, awaiting the war at the end of days. <coughs> Peyoton, my boy! <laughs> Come here, boy! A dog always forgives, but he needs you home. All of Northumbria does. <coughs> Do a last thing for me. Light the beacon for all to see, and let it burn. This is quite sad. We came following the sons of Ragnar Lothbrok because they had staked a claim to territories in England and we were following a great man's legacy because we knew the tales of Ragnar Lothbrok. And quickly gonna hit this. And obviously I've got to know some of his sons now and there's still some of his Drenga out there waiting for me to to send them to meet Ragnar basically. But I've sent one of his sons to him. Uba's still alive, but how long is that gonna last? I'm wondering if one of the conclusions to it is the gradual death of his Line and Eivor's Raven Clan taking their place. Has this been knocked down? No. If I'd climbed up the inside, I'd have known that. It's alright, I'll knock it down now. Just for consistency's sake. It is half done. Yeah. 
So what's next? I might have to do the dreams. I might have to do the dreams. I might not be able to... I might not be able to get any further, is what I'm trying to say, without doing Valka's dream sequences, which is sucky. I don't really want to do them. I never did. But I am guessing that it's an absolute necessity. I'm going to try and stock up quickly at the merchants, which I think is... That's not it, that's it there. You look striking today, Eivor. Thank you. May I see your stores? So what I want to do first is sell all the trinkets. Yeah, I can resell these. Can't have too many. There's a cloak. Don't know why that's there, but I'm gonna buy it I just in case I miss battles. it. I'll be sure to keep these in stock for you. You should buy that. What is this? Oh, some of these are pretty good. That's not. Short sword. Aha! Because some I think Perfection. And I mean that. People had I'm almost jealous at what I've made. Or commented on forums rather to Ubisoft saying they weren't happy that the There was no swords, despite the fact that Viking swords were some of the most sought after uh, weapons of their time because of the way they made them with their steel. Made from only the finest materials. You won't regret this purchase. Imported this with you in mind. Done shopping. I must be on my way now. Goodbye. That was pretty good. It's given me some see you soon. weapons that I've never tried in uh, in the game before. So that's pretty decent. Luckily, I've gathered these plants before. I wonder if I've got enough. Goods and gear to level up Valkas. I wonder if I can level up Valkas up. Surely she wants the big fancy um, house type thing that she had before, no? Apparently not. Oh well. I have the plan you ask for. It took some effort. Good, good. Thank you, Eivor. And now we're going to take another bad trip. Here you are. And be careful. This brew will feel as cold as ice on your lips. 
Yet will burn like a fire in your belly. Oops. Interesting glitch there. This is the third trip into the dreams we've taken. Can't remember how many there are. I think this might be the last one, because we got to the point the last time where we figured out that Loki had betrayed us once already by inviting the Builder in, and now he's basically slagged off Odin, saying that he couldn't do anything about his betrayal because there was a blood oath between them. Quest would be nice, no? That's where you can wake up if you don't want to play through till the end. any of the extra stuff in Val in Asgard because I don't really want to. I think it's you have to find these seed things and if you get so many I think you get an ability point which is such a disappointing reward for all the effort that you have to put in to get them. That did feel like padding to be fair. I don't know what I'm doing or where I'm going, by the way. There's no quest marker yet. <laughs> I thought he was going to speak to me. Well, there's somebody I can talk to. Can I? No. Cast about this land, my friend. What am I supposed to do? There's no No quests have come up. I think it's glitched when I've done the try the new potion thing. Do you know that? Because it's still saying try the new potion there. Give me a second, I'll see if I can just reload the autosave. not going to work. I might have to load a little further back. Have a look, Sunan. Yeah, I know I pushed the wrong button. Load. And if I go back to here.
by the time I get this working, it's going to be time to end this episode, but I want to know that I'm at least set up for the next part. Right. It's this one that I need to drink. That's what I did it wrong. It's my fault. I drank the first potion and I should have drank this second one. That's my fault. So I'll take the blame for that. I drank the one marked the Asgard potion when I should have drank the one with the quest marker above it. Because it'll take me to a different point in Asgard's history. Even although it's not actually Asgard we're seeing. We're seeing Eivor's interpretation of the Isu. This is better. The Saga of the Snows. Jotunheim arc started. Yggdrasil. Jotunheim. I have not set foot in this realm in some time. I must find the witch Angerboda. She knows all that happens here. Angerboda was really well done in God of War Ragnarok as well. Which, by the way, I've still not finished since I stopped recording it for the channel. I really should. But you know what? What time are we at? A minute and seven. An hour and seven minutes. An hour and seven minutes. Yeah, you know what? Let's let's call it here. And we'll start this from the next episode. And that way we're starting the new quest right at the beginning of the, the next part. So thank you for joining me for this one, guys. It looks like we've tied up all the alliances. So going forward, it looks like I'm going to have to tie off a few loose ends. So I'll need to see what it is they want me to do. I might have to look up might have to look up a guide just to see what's necessary for the end of the story because there's certain things I don't want to do unless I have to I don't want to go and do the Vinland saga unless it's necessary for me to kill all of the order to get the end game so we'll wait and see I think these Asgard episodes might be the only other necessary part so Thank you for joining me once again. Thank you for staying till the end of the episode. I do appreciate every single person that's made it this far. If you haven't already, like I said at the start, do the YouTube stuff, like the videos, comment down below underneath the video that you watch, and also subscribe to my channel. To help you with that, on screen in a moment, you should see three buttons in the middle of your screen. One is the icon for my channel. If you click on that, you'll be automatically subscribed. If you click on the image on the right hand side, that is a link to the playlist for the series. If you've missed anything, go back and watch it. It's one of my best series. I'm dead chuffed with this one. Image on the left hand side of the screen is a video that's been suggested for you. And in the top right hand corner of the screen, you should see a link to a curated video. Something that I am very, very proud of uh, that I have recorded on the channel. So, take care of yourselves guys, and I'll see you real soon for another episode. Thank you, and bye for now.